What is going on, everybody? My name is Pete, and you guys are watching Paid to Drive and Pay to Drive Vlogs, day number 1653. Coming at you once again, proudly presented by PayToDriveStore.com. Go check it out. Link's in the description. And uh, if you drive for apps like Grubhub, DoorDash, Uber Eats, or any of the others, you, my friends, are in the right place to stay up to date with what's going on in the gig economy. So get started right now for free. Hit that red subscribe button. There, yeah, hit that red subscribe button down below. Turn on all notifications so you're always up to date with what's going on in the gig economy. And of course, everybody, don't forget to hit that like. It takes half a second of your time. Just lets YouTube know that I'm doing a good job and all that good stuff. And leave a quick comment saying liked, L-I-K-E-D, just so I know you did it. And uh, that's that. So without any further ado, let's jump into the email. Triple Lindy Thornton Mellon style. And here we go. Finally got some good news here. I like to give you some good news once in a while when it actually happens. All right. So uh, this is from Ian. And he goes, hi, Pete. I received an order today for my local Japanese restaurant. The payout was listed as $6.75 for three and a half miles. Now, for you newer drivers out there, uh, you always want to try and at least get that dollar per mile from the restaurant to the customer. So you are getting that with this order. It's not the greatest, but you are at least getting the dollar per mile. Uh, when I got to the restaurant, it wasn't quite ready. As I always do, I messaged the customer through the app and gave them the heads up. Always a good practice. I do the same thing. Uh, he responded thanking me for the update and said, no rush. There you go. Once the order was ready, I advised him that I was on my way with a little smile emoji. As soon as I did that, I got an alert from DoorDash. The customer added another $7 in tips to the order. I've actually never seen this happen before. You know, it can happen. Just, you know, you catch the right person on the right day. This is why I always tell people stop treating DoorDash, Grubhub, and Uber Eats like just some schloppy, schleppy job that you have treat it like it's your own business and it will pay you like a business okay so as soon as i did that i get an alert da, 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 da. i've actually never seen that happen before when i reached the drop-off location the client was waiting outside for me he notice how he refers to him as not the customer but a client okay uh he was waiting outside for me he handed me an additional twenty dollars in cash okay I completed the order and it was actually for a total of $14.75, including the $7 additional tip. Of course, DoorDash had a hidden part of the tip on its original offering. We know that they do that. Um, in total, I got paid $34.75 for a three and a half mile order. Moral of the story, communicate with your customers and provide great service some people actually appreciate it and give you a nicer tip from ian ian let me tell you you get a round of applause everyone if you could in the comments put those little clapping emojis or if there's anyone in the premiere chat put some clapping emojis for this because this right here is textbook how you should be treating every customer. Now, I know people are going to say, Pete, what about those, those jerk customers that don't tip or leave a lousy tip? Treat everyone with respect, okay? Because remember, you know that saying, two wrongs don't make a right? So if a customer is screwing you over, to screw them over back, it'll, it'll almost always backfire on you, okay? Always remember something. If someone treats you badly in life, okay, I hate to say it, but what goes around comes around. It will come back to them. You may never witness it, but something will, will, will come back to teach them a lesson one way or another, okay? Always remember that. It is not your job to try and make someone's life hell, okay? It, I've been there, I've been that guy. So, the majority of my life, up, up until the last four or five years, I have been, you know, like, you know, a revenge kind of person, like, oh yeah, you did something bad to me, now I'm gonna go do something bad to you. You think it makes you feel better, but then when you actually do the revenge or whatever, you never really feel that good, okay? And if you do, well, I don't know what to tell you, but it ain't the way to go about things, that's for sure. This situation, play this video back anytime you are feeling like angry with a customer or whatever, because I'll tell you right now, Ian handled it well. 
drivers, dashers, let me know your thoughts in the chat or the comments about how Ian handled this. Are you like Ian or are you the revenge, you know, vengeful type person? Let me know down below. You definitely want to change that. If you guys ever have anything you want to share with me, a comment, a topic, a question, a story, an article, whatever you got, send me an email, paid to drive stories at gmail.com. It's the best way to reach me or for a quicker response, you guys can always message me through Patreon at patreon.com forward slash paid to drive. That link is in the description down below or the pin top comment. Definitely go and check that out. Uh, anyone who signs up as a patron as my way of saying thank you as I give you guys moderator privileges on my channel and I give you guys shout outs in all my videos, which I'm going to do right now. So when you hear your name called, say, hey, Pete, I heard my name. We have Ron Grubb, our tier five driver, followed by John Birchfield, David Moore, Angela Counts McCarty, Brian Pomeroy, Sean Gibson, Brian Medina, Heidi Barnes, Jimmy Santiago, uh, Joe Valerio, Kurt Paul, Laura Love, Tulsa Todd, Agus, April Julep, Alan G. Van Horn, Nick Gilroy, Drew Hanor, Todd Rosemanith, Fernando Carranza, uh, Frank, uh, let's see, uh, Frank Haviland, uh, Fresh One, Jason Kasa, Natalie Mosley, Sarah Keston, Scott Freisner, uh, Sherry Cassidy, Stephen Neely, Tom Perry, Chadrick Howell, Brian Richardson, Kayla Quintero, Candace Mitchell, Joyce Hine, LaDonna Roten, Matt Epperson, Nick G, Stacey Miller, Terrence Pacheco, Valerie Brown, Rebecca Swenson, Melody Longs, Kevin Roberson, Mel Chaos Lewis, and that's going to do it for today. So if you guys want to sign up, links are down below. Who's going to be the next patron? Maybe it'll be you. Let's go and find out. And uh, moving right along, I hope every single one of you guys out there is saving lots of money on your gas using the free gas app called Get Upside. That link is in the description down below or the pinned top comment. Just scroll down to where it says Get the Free Gas app. When you click on there, it'll tell you how to install it on whatever kind of phone, tablet, or device you have. And then from there, what you got to do is you go to your gas station, pump your gas, print out your receipt, take a picture of your receipt with the Get Upside Gas app. And within 48 hours or so, you'll get anywhere from 15 cents to 45 cents a gallon back, which is pretty fantastic. And if a friend or family member signs up using your code, you'll get paid every time they pump gas. It's called Get Upside. Links in the description. Make sure to download it today. And of course, Go check out paidtodrivestore.com. You can get one of these shirts or lots of other different designs and colors that we got. We have lots of things. Like I said, brand new designs, colors, sizes, you name it. We probably have it every day at paidtodrivestore.com. Go and check it out. If you made it to the end of this video, very grateful for all of you. Leave a quick comment saying END729, END729. Just lets me know you made it to the end of the video. Don't forget to subscribe with all notifications turned on and all that good stuff. Um, so you're always notified when I post something new. And also, are you all subscribed to my other channel, Team PTD? If you're not yet, there's a link in the description or the pin top comment. Do a quick YouTube search, Team PTD. Uh, subscribe with all notifications on, hit that like and all that. Uh, if you like the content here, you'll like the content there. Don't forget to drop a like on this video. It takes half a second of your time and it just lets YouTube know that I'm doing a good job and all that good stuff. And uh, leave a comment saying like, the L-I-K-E-D, just so I know you did it. And until next time, get that money, get that hunting, keep hustling, keep bustling. And we'll see you next time right here on Paid to Drive and Paid to Drive Logs. And as always, drive safe, be well, and we'll see you on the next one. Peace. Later.